Our family comes from the Philippines, and coming here was the American dream. Now that I'm first generation born American, Philippine American here in the city of Chicago, I want to have my dream come alive. And so when I saw guys that were making money driving the cars, I wanted to drive neighborhoods that they were living in and the homes that they were buying and the experiences and the vacations that they were traveling. Dude, I wanted some of that. But I realized I didn't know how to make a lot of money. I wasn't going to college. College wasn't for me. So I listened to the Marine Corps. And for the most part, a lot of Marines weren't getting wealthy either. You know, you don't join the Marines to make money. You join the Marines to serve our country. And so when the gift of entrepreneurship got exposed to me, when said somebody said, Matt, you like money? Yes. You like money? Yes. But do you know the rules? I don't know the rules. And then he taught me the rules. This mentor taught me the rules. He taught me free enterprise. He taught me the benefits of capitalism. And now, when I look at the last 18 years of my career, I'm looking for ways for me to help other people, to mentor other people, giving the common Joe a shot, giving the young 20-year-old Matt a shot, the young 20-year-old entrepreneur a shot. I love mentoring. I love coaching. I love depositing into them the mistakes I've made. So therefore they can avoid it, they can save themselves time, they can save themselves money, they can save themselves agony, and get to success much faster, much clearer, a lot more happier than I did. Invent yourself, and then reinvent yourself. Don't swim in the same slough. And stay out of the clutches of mediocrity. Invent yourself, and then reinvent yourself. Change your tone and shape so often that they can never categorize you. Reinvigorate yourself and accept what is but only on the terms that you have invented and reinvented. Be self-taught and reinvent your life because you must. It is your life and its history and the present belong only to you.